Hey, what's up everyone? It's Dave Stone with another exciting episode of Develop Awesome Skills where I am committed to providing inspirational and practical ways for you to transform your life and the world around you by planting fruit and medicinal trees. And today I'm talking about moringas again because you know how obsessed I am about moringas, but is your moringa tree looking like this? Kind of, kind of straggly and uh, got a ton of flowers on it. This had a lot of growth from last year, a lot of growth. In fact, this trunk is like twice the thickness that it was. So uh, what I'm gonna do today is we're gonna prune this tree. If your tree looks like this, it's time to prune it and, and get it ready for some brand new growth. So it's really easy to prune a Moringa, but I just wanted to show you this. So if your tree looks like this, the bees are loving it right now, but uh, we're gonna pull it off. Now these flowers can be processed and eaten. So they're really good. You can, you can process them by uh, just drying them out, and then you can make some tea with them as well, the flower tea. It's really, really delicious. So here's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna come down here and we're gonna pick some nice places to, to take these branches off so it can, it can establish some really nice new growth in here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take these branches off starting here. There's one. Get this one going. There's two. Right above this node where it's popping out growth, I'm gonna come in here. These are not one-handed shears. There we go. There's a nice little pod hanging on there, but uh, we need to prune this right now so it gets some nice new growth this year. Um, and these flowers that are on it right now still could produce some pods. So we just left a few flowers on there. Now it's gonna get a nice amount of new growth for the coming season. So that's how you prune your moringas. And here's what we got. A whole bunch of flowers. Um, if you wanted to boil this pod up, you really could. Could boil this pod but it's gonna make some nice tea and there's some nice leaves on here so that's the video for today I, I, it's a real quick one I just wanted to kind of show you guys uh, if your trees looking like this there's a way to encourage new growth and that's by pruning it heavily you could even take your tree way down here to the base and it would start producing a little more bushy of a tree so However you prune it is how it's gonna grow. I just wanna say thank you so much to my Patreon supporters. Uh, and if you guys do wanna support me, go to patreon.com forward slash develop awesome skills. And uh, just so you know, Patreon is a place where you can support your favorite artists so they can keep doing what they're doing. And what I'm doing is planting trees. So um, I appreciate all your support. And uh, if you guys wanna go to Facebook, join the I Want More Moringa Facebook group. There's 14,000 members right now from all over the world. Everybody's obsessed with Moringa. So post your Moringa pictures there. And, uh, and yeah, let's grow more Moringas. One million Moringas in five years, guys. And we got about four, a little over four years left. So we're gonna have to figure that one out. <laughs> but you guys are along for the ride with me. All right, well, if you guys like this video, give me a big green thumbs up, hit the little share button, uh, subscribe to the channel, hit that little bell icon so you know when I post next, and comment below what your favorite thing about Moringa is. So, uh, all right guys, well until next time, develop awesome skills. I love you guys.